To start with, diesel fuel is a very effective means of uh, fueling your or, or transportation. Although gasoline and diesel are both made out of petroleum products, the diesel fuels are not refined as much as what gasoline was, therefore it's not as volatile. Okay, but not as volatile, what I mean is the explosiveness of it. Okay, on a diesel fuel, you're going to, it's compression fired, which means you're going to have to run somewhere around 22 to 1 compression ratio in order to light the fuel versus your standard engine, which is going to fire at somewhere around 9.5 to 1 compression ratio with the aid of a spark. Diesel does not require a spark to ignite. Okay, with that being said, diesel is very, very effective for low RPM torque. That's why most of your big rigs and trucking companies, earth movers, stuff like that are going to go with a diesel fuel versus a gasoline. Some of the drawbacks to that is, especially in a passenger car, okay, the availability of it. Okay, now you're going to a truck stop or hopefully your local uh, filling station may have diesel at some point. And especially with the, ad the advent of mixing biodiesels with the diesel, which is nothing more than chicken grease, that they've reformulated and mixed with the diesel in order to use in passenger cars. I think this is a way to go in the future for green energy and renewable energy sources. However, it's not as effective as what a gasoline engine will be for all operating ranges.